first thing on our list is getting some munch because otherwise we're gonna starve and that's the most important part. There's a little, literally five minutes from our where we're staying. So, oh, sorry. There's literally a, there's literally a, a little <laughs> five minutes from where we're staying. So yeah, we're gonna go there and get munch. Where we travel a lot, we try and keep how much money we spend on food down, which means we don't go out to fancy restaurants or buy loads of expensive food. We're also both vegan, which makes it quite difficult to find certain types of food in certain places. in the bag. So by having an international food store like Lidl, it really helps us because we always know what we're getting. But just because we don't eat animal products, the principles stay just the same. For us, buying and cooking our own food when we're traveling is as cheap, if not cheaper, than eating at home. So the first thing on our list today is get the tram and then we're gonna head over yes. to Duomo Cathedral, which should be pretty dope. <laughs> dope. Dope. We also took a walk over to the Galleria Vittorio Emmanuel II, which is a shopping center next to the Duomo. We definitely, ow. We definitely can't afford to be here right now. There's your Gucci's, your Versace's, your... Location number two is this beautiful castle. Oh, my ankle. They seem to be, they seem to be like doing some construction on the front of it, this fountain's normally pretty much about, but yeah, doesn't make it any less pretty, but still. So we're now approaching one of our favorite places in Milan, which is a little park, which I will put the name of here because I can't remember what exactly it's called, <laughs> but it's in between these beautiful big old buildings here. So when we get there, we're gonna go chill on the grass. And now I'm gonna, well, we're gonna show you why it's, why it's your favorite place. <laughs> exactly, exactly. I'm devastated. Yeah. They're cut off the part where we sit on the grass, where the grass yeah. is particularly soft. We found yeah. this grass. And it's not bad. It's, it's, it's an average bad. grass, but it's pretty hard. Huh? I was really hoping to just lay back in that yeah. soft grass, but Maybe hey ho. So we last minute decided it'd be a great idea, well I did, decided to sign up for a race. So tomorrow I'm running a Stramilano 10k and we just got our little race pack thing, super random. So yeah, got some random Show bits, like some beans, some palitos, like little breadsticks. Beans, nuts, nuts? Yeah, oh yeah, nuts, nuts, <laughs> breadsticks, some shit. And then also got some little biscuits. Definitely aren't vegan. Yeah, probably not. Huevo. Well. They've, got, they've got eggs in them, but hey ho. <laughs> and then we also got. Ah, oh, where is that? Shampoo. Ooh. A I'm little gonna pen. Use that. Oh. And then there's also a little t shirt in it. Size Yay. S. Small, like I am. <laughs> Exciting. So yeah, we're going to run the 10k tomorrow. Yes. Hey, 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 hey. So we have left the park and we decided that we're going to go to a furniture exhibition, yeah, which my friend said to me, we've aged 40 years, yeah, maybe, <laughs> but we love furniture, so we're going to see how it goes. So yeah, we're going to go there now, show you guys how it is. Morning, we're at the race, my calves ache, <laughs> my body aches. But we're good and we're ready to go. So we're just sat outside the venue now waiting to start warm up and then yeah, get going. So I'm excited. 